We're finally back in the Adali region, huh? One step closer to hallowed Mount Galkalemthus. You know the real challenge begins once we're through Adali, right? Yeah, yeah, it's just a mountain. No big deal. Then we gotta find information about Chloe. The enemy is before us! Stay where you are! visit the village of Ada to restock. Good call. Midas might want to stop by there too. No need. Is this really the time for superfluous detours? Oh, come on. Just be honest with yourself for once. Enemies, dead ahead. Oh. This should do it. Threat neutralized. You're mine! We can exit from behind Elena's pot. Hence the shrine erected at its base. Compared to this, your climb to Ada was a morning constitutional. Noted. But if Osarians could scale this mountain a century ago, I see no reason why we can't. Might I remind you, Midas, you're still convalescing. And I heard Albert also fell ill at one point. Please exercise caution. Pardon me, but might it behoove us to pray for our safe passage? Not if you're in as much of a hurry as you say. If it's not too much trouble, I'd like to pray as well. Why? My pod crash landed in this shrine's sanctuary, leaving it in utter ruin. If a tutelor does preside over this mountain, I should apologize to it for my transgression. Isn't that right, Ray? As you wish. Losing one's footing here is likely certain death. Please, tread carefully so as not to slip and fall. We can now prevail! Destroy! Another day! 
We have company. They will be the last. Uh, 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 Suggest we make camp soon. I will take point. sleeps she does but why do you ask I doubt you understand this is clearly beyond your kin after all I have seen little would vex me about Ray or Elena but you saw what should be her muscles and bones those were no human innards I assumed it was similar to how we encountered the man with the horned pate a new race one with a drastically different anatomy I see. In actuality, what is Elena? She's what we call an android. A highly advanced mechanical doll modeled after a human. Pardon me, I find that hard to fathom. Leticia, the operative phrase here is highly advanced. Remember my Lagomore in Ada? I do. Would that think to pray to a god? Hmm... Well, no. Neither would Elena, and yet she was able to sense the anxiety in your facial expression. Make a moral appeal to Raymond and coax us in what she calculated would be the right direction. That is a feat even some of us humans cannot perform. Raymond, I must ask. Though she may be a doll, there must be something special about her, no? If you want to know if she's special to me, then yes. But if you mean in general, no. Where I'm from, you bump into androids everywhere. Preposterous, but also enticing. All right, I've made up my mind. Hmm? I do not believe we have discussed my payment for repairing Elena. As compensation, you will take me back to your homeland with you. Just so you know, that's not really for me to decide, but I'll put in a good word for you. I am not asking. Yeah, yeah, I heard you. Don't worry. I'll do all I can. What wonders abound there? Leticia? Huh? Uh, please, pay me no mind. Then the matter is settled. Now, may we endeavor to complete these fool's errands? 
And may a certain royal retainer come to terms with his fate? <sighs> I am certain he shall. Here goes nothing. about. Now we descend to the south. Prepare yourselves for battle! Remain close, Highness. Keep your distance! Firing! Destroy! Say goodbye! Firing! You're mine! Threat neutralized. Can you keep up? Destroy! Threat detected. We shall ahead. prevail. Firing. Do as you see fit. Thank you. 